Hello, 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 and welcome to episode one of the Random Nuzlocke Challenge Season 3 Pokemon Black. And these are the Pokemon that are going to be introduced soon into Pokemon Go. So let's get this game on the go. Okay, new game. Hi there, welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Professor Juniper. Yeah, I'm not doing no girl's voice. Everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. That's right, this world is widely inhabited by mysterious creatures called Pokemon. Pokemon have mysterious powers. They come in many shapes and live in many different places. We humans live happily with Pokemon. Living and working together, we complement each other. Yeah, I've always got uh, Pikachu telling me I'm a good guy. Uh, we help each other out to accomplish difficult tasks. Having Pokemon battle one another is particularly popular and it deepens the bond between people and Pokemon. Pretty sure that if you like got a stuffy uh, dog and like forced it to fight other dogs, it wouldn't deepen the bond, but... Anywho, and that is why I research Pokemon. Let's see. Well, that's enough about from me. Could you tell me about yourself? Are you a boy or a girl? I'm very much a boy. You're a boy, right? Hells to the air. I'd like to know your name. Let's call our guy Leon. Okay, cokes. Your name is Leon? Not really, but for the time being, why not? What a wonderful name. Yeah, it's alright. Well then, I'm going to introduce you to your two best friends. This young man is Cheren. He's like a bit of a tool. He can be a little difficult, but he's a very honest person. This woman is Bianca. She also looks like a tool. I make terrible choices in who to be friends with. She's a little flighty, but she works very hard. Uh, I think you free up potential, so I'm going to give you a very, very important Pokemon. Okay. The moment you choose a Pokemon that will accompany you on your journey, your story will truly begin. During your journey, you will meet many Pokemon and people with different Pokemon and people with different personalities and points of view. I really hope you find what is important to you in all of these travels. That's right, befriend new people and Pokemon, and new people and Pokemon grow as a person. That is the most important goal for your journey. Let's go and visit the world of Pokemon. Let's. It's the winter. 18th of August, winter. Sounds legit. I've just broken the screen doing that, haven't I? Yeah. Let's get that back to how it should have been. There we are. I heard from Professor Junica we can have a Pokemon. Good stuff. What's keeping Bianca? Am I a little late again? Sorry! Bianca, I've known for 10 years that you have no sense of time, but seriously. That's a lot of exposition in that sentence. Today, today we get a Pokemon for Russia Juniper. I know, sorry Leon, sorry Cheren. So, where are the Pokemon? They were delivered to Leon's house, so Leon gets first pick. Damn right I get a first pick. Let's have a look inside the gift box. Okay. Let's see what we got. I bought three Pokemon, one for you and one for each of your friends. Please settle your choices politely, enjoy your Pokemon. Yeah, I'm just gonna pick whatever I want. 
That's the choices that's going down. Okay, so in ball number one, we have the normal type Pokemon Deerling. Okay. Ball number two, the psychic type Pokemon Muna. Looks, looks like that would evolve into something cool. Holy crap, the dragon type Pokemon Kyruum. Well, we're going to start with that bad boy. That looks like a legendary all day. Is this the Pokemon you want? Yes, it is. I've got high hopes for this uh, Nuzlocke, if that's how it's starting. Okay, I'll take this Pokemon, Cherry, and this one's yours. Hey, how come you get to pick out my Pokemon? There we go, Kyruum is on the team. Never mind, I'll get this one from the start anyway. Oh yeah, I'm sure you did. Let's have a Pokemon battle. Why not? Shouldn't even have Pokemon battles inside a house. The little ones are weak, like you said. We have to let them battle so they'll get stronger. Hit settled, Leon. Ready for a Pokemon battle. Fairly confident I'm going to kick her. That's really poor. Kyrum is exerting pressure. What will we do? Fight. It's a psychic type, so. Ugh. Ice and dragon. Let's just assume dragon rage will do enough. Okay. Yeah, one hit KO. This Nuzlocke's going to be an absolute breeze. Okay, Pokemon on both sides are the best. <laughs> One didn't even get a shot in. Wow Leon, you're going to be an awesome trainer someday, I can tell. No doubt. Yeah, starting with a Legendary is your first Mon there. Uh. So while we're going through this so starting bit, the rules of an Nuzlocke is you can only catch the first Pokemon you encounter in each route once you get Pokeballs. If the Pokemon faints, it's dead, you can't use it anymore. If you lose all your Pokemon, the Nuzlocke's over and you have to start again. Also, I've locked it so it's just going to be Gen 5 Mon so we can have a look what's happening soon in Pokemon Go because Gen 5 has been hinted at coming soon. It's amazing that you won without your Pokemon losing any energy, which is called HP. But you use some of them as power points of PP, though. Ah, there we go. Let's see, yeah, does Cheron want to go? Yeah, battle two. With all you know, I'm sure you can battle without turning the room into a disaster area like I did. I believe you're right. It'll be no problem for me to keep the room from getting any messier. Besides, it's not fair if you two are the only ones who get to have fun battling. This society will be in my Pokemon in our first Pokemon battle. Let me see what you can do. Okay, so this guy's got a normal type. Exerting our pressure, what we're going to do. Fight. We'll use Icy Wind, give him a chance, because that Dragon Rage is probably a little bit overpowered for level 5. <laughs> Super effective, Ice against normal. Okay. I must have dual typing, that doesn't make sense to me. 
cheeky level to start it off. And let's see. I made a strange blunder in my first battle, but this feeling I have, I'm finally a trainer. But first, we better go apologise to your mother about this messed up room. Oh, I better come too. Right, so it's my house they've trashed. Good to know. Oh, I suppose technically it's me who did all the trash in there, but what are you going to do? <clears throat> going to have a slurp of coffee, that's what I'm going to do. I'm very sorry about all the trouble, ma'am. Sharon's such a suck up. Well, um, we can clean up. And she's flaky as hell. No way is she considering doing anything to help. Cleaning up, no worries. I'll take care of it later. My mum has never been that chill in her entire life, I promise you that much. Uh, shouldn't you be on your way to meet Professor Juniper? Yes, thank you. Please excuse us. Come on, let's go thank Professor Juniper. Hells yeah, we're thanking Professor Juniper. Uh, I'll be waiting in front of the Pokemon Research Lab. Good to know. Oh wait, I've got to go home first. Thanks for having us over. Yeah, just come round and trash my house. I assume we probably should say goodbye to our mum. No. To us anyway. My, my, Leon. Pokemon battles are so lively, aren't they? I could hear the Pokemon cries clear down here. Not surprised, Dragon Rage. <laughs> hmm, that sure reminded me of my first Pokemon battle. Oh, and you know, after battle, you need to rest your Pokemon. Don't think you could really call those two skirmishes battles, but your Pokemon is looking great. Now, if you're going out, don't forget your cross transceiver. Okay. Ah, my watch. You'll obtain the X transceiver. Key items. You're going to thank the professor too, right? Better get going, honey. Okay. Let's have our first look at the world. November Town, the start of something big. Let's see what this chap's got to say for himself. The power of science is amazing. Now you can use infrared to do all sorts of things in the blink of an eye. That sounds great. Whose ass is this? Sharon's dad. Hello, Leon. I had it from the professor, so you're getting a Pokemon, eh? Oh, you already got it? Hmm, that sure is a cute Pokemon. Would we call Kyrum cute? You all finally start new journeys as trainers. But let me read you a passage from a book called Adventure Rules. The expression is vitally important for trainers, never forget that. That's the point, why haven't I been able to name my Pokemon? There's an ice dragon. Big special attack. Pretty big everything though to be fair. Is that all it's gonna tell us about him? Alright, there we go. That's about his moves. annoyed I've not been able to record him anything, but there we go. Let's speak to uh, Charon's mum. Charon, I'm sure, is at the laboratory. He so how would I put it, diligent, or better, conscientious. That's big words this early into a Pokemon game. Can we rob his house? He's got a computer. Adventure rule number one, the X button opens the menu. Record your progress for save. So, that's the X button. Also, photo the menu. 
What's on telly? It's cool for cartoon. Pokemon trainer Leon. Is that on the journey to become the champion a year ago? Okay, so I've already got my own TV show. Good to know. She said she was going to her house, so let's see what's going on. No, no, a thousand times no. Oh, she's got a strict daddy. All about a girl with daddy issues. But I'm I'm a good trainer who's sort got a Pokemon and everything. I can totally go on an adventure. Oh, it's okay. It's fine. I'll be waiting for you in front of the lab, okay? So, she's got strict parents. What nonsense is this? You're a dick. How could my daughter, who knows nothing about the world, be going on a journey with Pokemon? First concerned parent I've ever seen in a Pokemon game, so it's taken five games to get there. Don't mind my husband, dear. He's just being overprotective. All children go on adventures with Pokemon. Oh, that's a bit more like the uh, parents in we used to from the Pokemon series. It's part of growing up. It's a very unusual world, but it's part of growing up is to go and catch animals and force them to fight one another. That's my house. Oh. Who's this little guy? Or girl? I've heard there are a lot of po Pokemon and many different people in the world. When I hear stories about them, I get very excited. Well, there's 156 in this gen. And it's only going to be this gen because some of those are coming to Pokemon Go very soon. Okay, let's go meet the professor. Hi there, I've been waiting for you young people. Let me introduce myself again. My name is Professor Juniper. <laughs> hey! That's what I was going to say. We know your name. Alright, Charon's growing on me very quickly. Come, come Charon, this is not a time to take things lightly. Today is a day to remember always, so it's best to behave with some formality. That being so, once again, my name is Professor Juniper, and I am researching when and how the creatures called Pokemon came into existence. Okay. Oh, that's unusual. You already had a Pokemon battle, so maybe that's why. It feels about your Pokemon have already begun to trust you. By the way, would you like to give your Pokemon a nickname? Yes, we would. Right. An Ice Dragon. That is only one name I can go for being a massive EverQuest fan. The ultimate Ice Dragon herself, Lady Vox. Are you okay with the nickname Lady Box? Hells yeah. Welcome to the team, Lady Box. That's such a great name. It is a great name, Professor Juniper. I'm particularly proud of myself as well. As for why I save all of you Pokemon, I gave all of you Pokemon. Their S's and G's in this look very similar. It's for the Pokedex, right? Pokedex? I'm astonished. Nice work, Sharon. Yeah, he's been uh, snooping through your trash. He's a bit of a creep, to be honest with you. You've already studied Pokemon extensively, haven't you? Nope, just the contents of your garbage. Still, let me explain everything from the beginning for everyone's sake. 
The Pokédex is a high-tech device that automatically records the Pokémon uh, you encounter. So I want you three to visit many places and meet all of the Pokémon in the Inova region. That's the plan. This is my request. Leon, Cheren, Bianca. You'll go on an adventure to complete the Pokédex, will you not? Yeah, why not? Okay. I mean, yes, Professor. Thank you very much. Because of you, I can become a Pokémon trainer exactly as I always wished. All of you, thanks. You have given me the best possible answer. And there is our Pokédex. Next, I need to teach you how to meet Pokémon. Please meet me at Route 1. <sighs> Since the Professor House says it's okay to go on an adventure, right? I can explore, maybe find out what I want to do in life. I think I'd like that. Of course. We can travel however we want while we complete the Pokédex. Oh, let's get on the road. Hey, Leon, wait up. And what did the professor have to say? She asked you to complete the Pokédex? I can't believe it. Well, believe it. Well, actually, I can. I already knew she was going to ask. What? <laughs> That's why I bought you the three of you these town maps. Take them with you. All right, well, we're getting all the items out of the way early. Key items. I'll take good care of it. And one for you too, Bianca. Thank you so much. As for your room, Leon, or what's left of it, no need for any of you to worry. I'll take care of tidying up. Okay, Leon? Uh, Pokemon, they're so cute, but they have enough power to destroy a bedroom. They are really something. Uh, Pokemon like that at your side, you'll be safe wherever you go. I'll let your parents know. I hope that in addition to Pokemon, you've had lots and lots of places you like in the Nova region and become wonderful adults. Have a great trip. No promises on becoming wonderful adults, I'll be honest with you. If I use a time map, I'll always know where I am. That's certainly helpful. Shall we head to Route 1? The professor's waiting. There's a lot of reading in this first bit. Let's go, let's go, Leon, hurry and come too. Apparently we're going right. Leon says, well yeah, I can see that. Bianca says if we're starting a journey together, she wants us all to take our first step at the first time. Hey Leon, let's take our first step on Route 1 together. One, two... Okay, Route 1. Now the Lord's Up Challenge hasn't started yet because we've not been given any balls. But this will give us an idea of what kind of mons we've got a chance of catching here. The professor's waiting. Uh, Press the button, I'm sorry to keep you waiting. Now that everyone's here, I'll explain. The Pokédex pages update automatically whenever you meet a Pokémon. Moreover, it's set up so that you obtain even more information when you catch a Pokémon. To make this clear, I'm going to demonstrate how to catch a Pokémon. Tutorial time! Yay! A wild patch rat appeared. So, Mincinko. That's a cool Pokemon. It looks a bit like a beaver who's smoked far too much pot with those red eyes. Use Pokeball after you've lowering its HP, yeah. Okay. Gotcha, Patrat was caught. Good for you. Did you see that just now? Here's how it goes, step by step. Let's just get through that. Okay, we've got Pokeballs. The Nuzlocke challenge is on. I think we're going to do our first catch on this route and then that will be the end of the episode for people watching on YouTube. Obviously on Twitch it continues. If you are watching on YouTube, subscribe to twitch.tv forward slash Immortalis Dynasty if you want to uh, watch live when we're recording these. Pokeballs are used for catching Pokemon and for carrying the Pokemon you catch. 
I'm going on ahead. I'll be waiting for you in Accumula Town. Now, apparently, this game's based in America. It looks very Midwestern, I'd say. She forgot to save up Pokemon, jump out at you in tall grass. I'm heading to Cumulo Town too. I think I'll go too. I'm looking forward to the next town so I can go shopping for Pokeballs. Wait a minute. Hey, listen, Leon, Sharon. I thought it was something fun. We need to get going, I'd imagine the professor's waiting too. Would you just listen to sex seriously? Why don't we see who can catch the most Pokemon? Well, it's not going to be me. I'm on a Nuzlocke challenge. Girl. The person carrying the most Pokemon, including the one received from Professor Juniper, is the winner. Huh? Actually, that sounds interesting. It will fill up Pokedex pages, so I'm sure it will please Professor too. Okay then, until we reach Cumulative Town, take care of healing your Pokemon at your own house. Me and Tepis will do the best for sure. Alright. What is... how many Pokeballs you should give us, actually, before we get to... Uh, Bag. Did she literally give us one Pokeball? No, fine, okay. Okay, and our first encounter is... Is... Here we go. Well, he looks cool as hell. Elgium. Level 2. Ah! Now this could be the problem. Can Lady Vox land a hit on something without one hit KOing it? So we have a chance to catch it. In fact, he's level 2, so let's just try throwing a, bat uh, a ball at it to start with. One, two, three. That's what we're talking about. Welcome to the team. All right. Data was added to the Pokédex. You use its strong psychic counter to squeeze its opponent's brain, causing unendurable headaches. Three Pokémon. Psychic, which is good type covering, because I don't think anything that's good against Dragon and Ice is going to be good against Psychic. So I'm well happy with him. Uh, give him a name. He's got a big Y on his forehead. Names beginning with Y. Catch you tomorrow for the second episode. And